The 0 1. Just missed outside. Ooh. That's that big breaker right there, Kenny. That ball looked like it was very close. See, to share it first base, about even with the bag. So if a ball is hitting his direction, he has the opportunity to come home and get the four. So the home to first double play. Two and one. Tell Miller he's battling, but he just doesn't have as great control, not as sharp as he usually is. And up to 29 pitches, so you've got both the Batantis and Miller off tomorrow. Huge game for the Yankees right here. Rutledge at third, Pedroia at second, Bogarts is at first. 13 hits for the Red Sox, two runs, six hits for the Yankees, three runs. Two one. Did he go? No, he did not. Three and one, and there's no place to put Ortiz. You know about that one, Kenny. I'd like to see the replay because it looked like his bat head went way out. Uh -huh. uh, it's close. Phil Coke warming in the bullpen for the Yankees. Miller sets pitch oh, three and two and Ortiz is not happy and out of the dugout comes Farrell. Wow. Oh, they just gave Ortiz a lot of leeway right there and now Farrell gets thrown out of the game by Culpa. He gets himself thrown out instead of Big poppy getting thrown out. Man, it's a good job by a manager. Obviously, you've got to get him back in this at bat. You know, this such a nasty picture to see where this location was. McCann wasn't able to come up with it. He got crossed up. It's a total cross up. I think it's a strike, but he was crossed up, and the way he actually caught yeah. the ball made it look like a ball to Big Poppy. Well, I tell you what, that's a good job by McCann to get leather on it. Here's the 3 2. Strike ah. three. Ortiz down looking. Yankees one out away. You're absolutely right about the 3 1 pitch. Why is Farrell still in the dugout? He was just ejected. And now you can see Culpa saying, go. Now he threw out Ortiz. <laughs> kind of not fair to Miller, who has to stand on the mound and watch this. And Culpa says, all right, get lost. Night's over. Now, Tori Lavolo is the uh, bench coach, and he's the acting manager with Farrell well, out of the game. You know, they got upset at the 3-1 pitch. And I think they caught a break. Well, the Yankees did because McCann was actually able to stop it, and the way he caught it made it look worse than the pitch actually was. I, I agree with you 100%. So he slams his equipment, here's he's ejected, and then he comes back out, fired up. There's still some fire left in this rivalry. But there's still some work to be done. Andrew Miller has to face the very dangerous Hanley Ramirez.